Hi, this is Jason. Welcome to my Season 5 review of Cobra Kai. We last left off on Season 4 where Terry arrested Kreese and puts him in prison. And Miguel's going to Mexico to find his father. And Tori found out that, like, um, Silver paid off the referees for her to win the whole girls tournament. A lot of, a lot of twists and turns going on in Season 5. But the thing about Season 5 is, even though it's not as good as Season 4, Season 1 to me is my favorite episode, my favorite, episode, my favorite season of Cobra Kai. It's still a solid season. It's still really good. You got some new characters like um, Kim Dong Un and a few others from like uh, the Korean episodes when uh, when young Silver Young Kreese went to Korea to to train more of the martial arts. I think you got Master Kim. I think I think that's in that season or maybe seasons before, but that was like what he's really introduced was season five. And then you got um, a big melee at the very end of the season with like um, with all the Cobra Kai's and all the Miyagi Do slash Eagle Fang members going at each other and then you have Mitch going like uh, a heel turn all of a sudden from being Eagle Fang Miyagi Do to being a Cobra Kai for about a cup of coffee <laughs> I thought that was pretty cool then you found out that like um, Johnny's girlfriend uh, Carmen got pregnant so, like, um, Miguel being, like, Carmen's son and Robbie being Johnny's son, they're at, they're at odds at each other. And then, like, uh, Johnny had a way to get, get them, like, uh, get their anger out of their system in a unique way. Originally, it's going to be, like, a Young Guns type thing because Johnny was watching Young Guns and he thinks, oh, that could work. <laughs> and all of a sudden, that didn't work. But the... But the fine thing, like, um, to get off their system was, so that's good on them for actually trying to get over their differences. And then you have the very end of the show where, like, uh, I don't know, show, end of the season where Kreese escapes from prison, poses as a psychiatrist to escape from that prison. And he's been on the run since. And Silver got arrested because he was exposed for what, what his tactics were for Cobra Kai and what really was about, thanks to, the, I think, one of the kids that, like, uh, oh, Dimitri. Dimitri was the one that, like, uh, put uh, Silver in prison with his, like, uh, MIT genius <laughs> on, on their security. So that's, uh, that's gotten Dimitri for putting, like, Silver and his goons arrested. Anyway, it's a really good season. It's not as good as the fourth season, in my opinion, but like I said, people like season five or season four, which I understand, because season five has more at stake than season four. But at the same time, I think I like season four a little bit better. Because it has a little bit more of what I like, like the comedy, the drama, and the action mixed all together. But here, it's more... Yeah, you have comedy there, but it's mostly just drama and action. Which is fine. I like, I like them. It's just that I prefer season four over season five. For that reason. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed my review. I will review Cobra Kai season six part one tomorrow. Late.